my friends so do you want to automate of course you do right we all want to automate and one of the things that I did a while back was I used heavily mini chat Facebook comments and I also added ads in there to increase the connection the connections and the and the growth and all that and one of the things that I just started doing again recently is to reintegrate ManyChat into my strategies now if you haven't used ManyChat before it's a chat bot for messenger it basically allows you to uh, take actions and send messages to people using Facebook messenger which they say has a huge difference in terms of open rates in terms of uh, interaction compared to just emails right so but the thing is that how do you use it efficiently and let's talk about how I'm using it in the software uh, launch that I'm doing right now how you can do that too and we're going to show you that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so mini chat what is mini chat or you probably already know what it is but let's me just show you my screen here and show you kind of results I I got in the past where's my webcam so this is one of my old pages that's no longer valid this was in 2017 as you can see I went all the way to 872 I grew quite a bit in about a month right here and that was back in the day where bitcoins were doing crazy and I was uh, heavily into that and one of the mistakes I made was to pivot my existing audience into bitcoins and that's why I lost the page and I lost all these contacts now because it's in many chat you don't actually have access to any of these afterwards you can still see the results you can still see that I had well today I have 428 active contacts in this uh in this many chat page but I I don't really have access to them because they're but as you can see there was 869 new contacts in there net contacts 1074 back then I had uh, six, 61 flows 31 growth tools um I had uh you know it doesn't show ads I had two sequences um and all that right that was all that was kind of how I was using it now today I'm using um on my new on my newer page the JS Gagnon page that I still haven't set up the pro I, I did have the pro back then because one of the things is that with the pro you can't have uh you can't have there's certain things there's limits and all that but uh so I'm going to be doing that soon but right now I'm still using the free version and you can use the free version too and what I do with it is I basically um have a couple of um uh where is it it's not what I want it's not flows it's under da -da 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 uh growth tools yeah so I have a three right now comment growth tools as you can see I don't have any impressions in on these two ones because they're brand new that I just set up a couple day, a day yesterday or day before this one here is showing me 17 impressions seven opt-ins which means a 41 percent conversion and then 100 percent of people that actually got the message actually opened it and out of the out of those 67 percent of them clicked I mean compare that to aweber a emails let me just show you what what whoops that's not right <laughs> aweber compare that to aweber I probably should have opened that before I showed you but if I look at say for example my messages here my broadcasts these are the messages that I sent every day out in my list right as you can see percentage wise it's totally ridiculously nothing right two percent open seven percent ten percent fourteen right fifteen 0 0.2 0 0.7 0 0.5 like it's it's there's nothing compared to what you get out of something like mini chat right out of look <laughs> just 17 impressions seven opt-ins 41 percent that's like that's like you know compared to like I said seven percent ten percent fourteen percent that's the open rate so this is the open rate 41 percent versus like five and ten percent um and then uh, well, actually that's not true well there's yeah so there's two parts to the conversion on mini chat it's when you first send them a message it's whether they actually opted in right so it's not really the open rate right here because this is these are new subscribers so this is so that's that's after I sent them a message after they're subscribed right 
that which would be the open rate over here right this open rate right here which is 100 open rate 100 open rate compared to five percent ten percent right that's insane and then click rate 67 percent of those who opened it which is all of them right so I don't it doesn't show me a number here but I guess opt-in conversion so I guess yeah so the seven people that opened it actually clicked I don't know if you can can you go I forget it's been a while no that shows me the actual growth the actual um what it is right so okay so here's the thing so under Facebook let me just go to my page so under Facebook so how do you do that right how do you do all these different how do you connect all these things together right so the first thing you got to do is you got to create a post in Facebook you create a post in Facebook and then you link it to many chat and then you can maybe have an ad on it so I'm going to do that right now because I actually have another post I'm supposed to be doing for my new tool my new comment grabber uh but then that's not it that's not right well I mean is that I guess that's one of the things you might have you might have not seen yet but this is a comment grabber a funnel that's the wrong that's the wrong window where's the no it's over here no <laughs> where is my tab that was on oh there it is okay so that's the one I this is the I'm on Facebook I'm on my page right so you gotta have first of all you have to have a page a business page a fan page whatever you want to call it in Facebook to be able to integrate with mini chat right so if you don't already have a business page you don't have to go create one because you can't interact with your personal profile that's against Facebook rules even though I teach how to create a Google Chrome extension that'll actually interact on the personal side of your page it's not impossible to do just it's just something Facebook doesn't want so if you're if you want to use a, a, a plugin or an extension like that you have to kind of be careful make sure you don't um uh you do, don't overuse it right don't don't automate it like crazy do like five ten messages a day kind of thing whatever you can do that with uh, plugins with extensions for chrome but uh, if you want to follow the rules you got to have a facebook page so i this is my facebook page right now i probably should update my my cover photo and all that that's uh something i i need to work on but for now let's just say we want to create a post and i have to create a post and that's what i was trying to figure out here which one is it is that is this the one here must be this one yes this is the one all right so now I'm going to go back to my post I got to go and find my second post I want to do which I haven't actually really given that that much thought so my second post is about um doing an affiliate program now I do have an affiliate program for my uh, for my um pl uh, extension I I want to use that I just haven't set it up but I guess it doesn't really matter so I will post this like this I'm just going to take this I'm going to copy this here and I'm going to go into my I'm going to create a post right going to post that in here this is basically a copy from somebody else so I'm going to it's uh it's not so it's comment grabber right so would you like to earn I'm going to give you 50 percent actually of the lifetime of every customer you refer by promoting my new software comment grabber uh this game changer for Facebook organic marketing you'll be seeing it everywhere very soon this opportunity for you to get in during our pre-launch and earn commissions on truly irresistible if you want to become an affiliate comment affiliate below so ps if you have a big engaged audience that you believe this offer is perfect for we can also schedule a jv training interview in your group or platform to make it even easier for you just shoot me a message more info at that's obviously not it's comment grabber and i'm just gonna just take that out of there okay http and comment affiliate oh look at that it's actually got the right interesting I didn't uh, comment affiliate if you want uh, in on this opportunity while they're picking okay so now I've got this post that I'm going to just create and and then uh, let me just see here <coughs> okay there's the cut. okay so now so now I've got this post that I want to post right so and I want to integrate and so that as you can see right here in this post I'm asking people to comment affiliate right in the comments and I don't know why there's a I guess the hashtag is probably better 
uh and comment grabber so um let me see for now that's just a link to the actual uh capture page which is fine but if people want to know more about the software they they I should probably do a new page anyways that's a separate thing let's just talk about the actual uh the actual content here and uh and by the way if you're listening to the audio of this you might be thinking what am I showing I'm showing screenshots of my pages and I'm showing I showed screenshots of mini chat all these different things so make sure you go to cis uh three two eight dot jsgagnon.com cis328.jsgagnon.com to go check the video and blog post so you can see all what I'm doing right here right okay so now I've got the post so I'm going to create the post right so the first thing I want to do is I just want to create the post right I'm going to go and just post it like this which um into an offer blah 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 I'm not going to do that because they want me to make it uh, they want me to promote it right away I want to set up mini chat first so now I've got this post that I've got in here that I actually have on my page right so now it's in my page now how do I integrate that with mini chat well I go to mini chat and I just go into growth tools right and by the way I think the limit is four so we should be good I'm going to create for the free account right so I'm going to go to Facebook comments 2.0 right here and what I do is I just uh, use a specific post select the post and I'm going to go in here I'm going to say is it okay that's the one I want right so I want this one and I want to track first level comments only and I want to affiliate I want to if they put affiliate in the comments right I don't know if I have to put this thing like this but we'll do that and then I want to set info so more info and details so people they could say something like this right depending on what they're asking so that so this basically says to many chat that I want you to reply only if they put those comments in there right not for anything um exclude text you could put in there things like like scammer um scam because some people will say things like that you don't want to you know include them in there right so I'm you could do something like that right so next you click on the next button right there and you have an auto response which so the first thing that happens is if they comment you want to say well what is it that you want to reply to their comment right so I'm going to say um great happy to have you on board check your inbox check your inbox okay so that'd be one so now I can put more it's better to put more because there'll be different replies right awesome you'll love it just sent you sent you a pm <clears throat> okay then I want to say great let's chat check your pm <clears throat> okay um happy to have you on board well I guess it's the same thing I said that but anyways on board on board uh just sent you a pm with details and I can do that multiple times right so I can actually take this same thing and I can say awesome instead awesome and I can say great great <coughs> uh, a private message in, with details right I can change things like that um and what and whatever you can add as many as you want what'll happen is 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 it'll pick one I don't know if it's round robin or if it's random or whatever but the other thing you can do too is you can say like comment so if they if they comment you like the comment and you send you add this message here right next is the what message you send them in in your inbox so first we have to save this right then we edit the message so the message is going to be it starts like this hey thanks for adding your thoughts to the conversation which you know maybe I want to change that thank you for your interest your whoops your interest in my affiliate program for comment whoops comment grabber 
okay um I click the option below or type a reply to start okay so now I'm going to say add a button it's going to be more info and let's just uh, do that so more info and then we're just going to say send a message so basically what we're doing is we're adding a new message to the um to here right it'll be the new message right there and this will be comment type it'll be a comment reply okay so over here I want to say great find out more at the at the following okay well great as you know this well so I'm I'm launching this new software called comment grabber on March 1st 2021 you can get in on the affiliate program at 50 percent until then this will give you 50 percent commission commission on lifetime renewals and sales and the uh, pre-release sales and pre-release sales sales as well sales as well <clears throat> so um go to the click the button click the button to register okay so for now so let's just uh I'm gonna add a button here actually inside of my comment funnels I believe that there is in, in my funnel I have a page which I haven't uh, done yet click funnels there's a page in my funnel that I haven't yet done right so let's go to my funnels and the comment grabber launch and I think there's a funnel page in there that I haven't done start now order now I'm not really sure I'm not really sure but I will have to let's reset this I'm not sure I'll have to work on that but let's for now I'm just going to put a link here so register uh let's register as a fill fill it okay so I'm going to open a website and it's going to be http affiliate.commentgrabber.com so I'm just going to fix the URL later so that that goes to the right page for now it's just going to go to the normal uh the normal page so if anybody you know comments on this post until then then that that's it's just going to take them to the regular one but they can always uh just ask about it right okay so now we have so let's just close this up if I make it smaller so now you can see that this is the the flow that's going to happen when somebody first comments on the post they're going to enter into this particular step right there and then they're going to get this message from the bot which has a button here with more info right and then they have this and then I'm going to make this actually go here and that means that if they type something it'll also show them this right and um yeah so then I just publish this oh button title must be less than 20 characters really oh why didn't you tell me before register let's say become affiliate so is that better publish there we go okay so now we have that like this we have it say become affiliate right there then more info here that's going to go to a, a page what is that okay uh whoops cancel okay so now we have the integ well it's not totally done yet I have to go back to growth tool here and then I have to activate it okay so now it's activated that means that if somebody comments on that right now in my in my post then they're going to get this response right so if I go in here and I comment I don't can I how do I do that I want to comment say as my ask general search page and I'm going to say find uh let's say a affiliate right and then that's going to go and it's going to reply within a few seconds it shouldn't take too too long I don't know how long it takes but look it says astronaut commented on JS Gagnon's link that's the notification for this 
right and let's see what happens if I reload is it gonna do I have to wait let's reload the page I'm, I'm not sure how long it takes to in for this to happen right there's two comments now see it says two comments to the one right so let's just uh, view the comments whoops two comments there you go affiliate look at that there's a reply it says awesome you'll love it just sent you a pm so now I can go it says comment turn on by mini chat now your reason why it says that by the way is because it's a free account that I have on mini chat if you, if I was to go with a pro I'd, I get rid of these things right so only people who manage this page can see who posted a comment I guess it's only me that sees it though okay so actually it won't I guess it won't say that I thought it did automatically but okay so now if I look in my messages well actually I won't be able to see it here I have to go to my other page if I go to my other page my ask Jean Serge page and I go into my inbox you're now interacting as a Jean Serge let's see if we can see this message messenger right here now if I click on messenger I will see this message look at the, this is Shelly no oh this is just messenger where's how do I see the messages for that page because that's other hmm I don't know oh this is still Gia's going out inbox why is it this Gia's going out inbox I'm not really sure how you're supposed to see is it did let me see on my phone if it came in on my phone here mm -mm -mm. I don't even know how to how to get messages from that for that user uh, that's interesting maybe it doesn't send a message to a regular user right so uh anyways don't worry about it if you if you actually use the if I actually use my real profile let's go back to the page here if I go to this page and I just say interact as myself right I'm going to interact as myself I'm going to say affiliate as well and again it's going to enter me as a so I guess if I go to a mini chat I'm just curious here if I go to my uh audience does it show me as a new person yeah there's well I'm I'm already there I guess I've oh yeah that won't really growth tools if I go back to here there's two impressions there's no opt-ins yet because I never got the message right but now if I go back to here now I did get the message from my page hey Jean Serge thank you for see I get this now right if I open this up thank you for let's move my webcam out of the way here it says thank you for your inter interet oh I gotta fix that interest in my affiliate program for comment grabber click the options below or type uh, reply to start I'm just gonna type awesome and hopefully that'll do what I'm yep there you go oh no that's not good uh, that's not good I don't want to do that so I guess if I type more info is that going to work there you go well, I guess the yeah I guess that I'm launching this new software called common grabber you can get in on the affiliate program at 50 percent until then this will give you 50 percent commission on lifetime renewals and pre-release sales as well click the button to regest, register so if I click on this it's actually going to go to my to my normal uh page which isn't really where it's supposed to go actually look at that it's not even going to there that's weird why didn't it go to the oh because it's https why did it do that it should did I okay it's got to be http so let's let, let's edit this uh the message edit um I'm going to change that click click more info to start to continue <clears throat> okay so in my affiliate interest oh, let's fix that interest right interest okay so there that's fixed there but the other thing I want to fix is this one is supposed to go to why see it says HTTP hmm oh yes I anyways that's no okay that's fine that's what it's supposed to do right now so that's fine so I'm just going to publish this everything is good okay so now it's all good now if I look at the growth tool you see I have two impressions one opt-in 50 percent conversion and opened and clicked 100 percent right so 
that's kind of how you integrate with ministry now how do we do the ads now the ads is a creation of an ad and that allows you to um have more engagement right so if I click if I do this I'm going to create a new ad I go into ad manager now one of the things is I'm not showing you how to create your ad manager or how to set it all that but I'm just going to go and show you how to create the if you haven't done Facebook ads yet there's there's I have other training you can go through to my blog to go find out but for now we're just going to say I want engagement because this is uh buying, buying type auction hmm. okay anyways it doesn't matter uh, whatever post engagements is what I want continue and I'm gonna and now there's different ways you I could go to the post and say boost right that would be another way right but for now I'm just gonna say uh like this I'm not gonna worry about the name um daily budget uh, than usual so I'm gonna say five dollars a day <coughs> and then let's go to the doo -doo 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 -doo. <coughs> okay next right over here and what we're going to do is we're going to say start date for night nine that's today that's fine I'm going to use a saved audience I want to use my um my CIS three second viewers these are the ones that already know me that have been watching my videos and it's got a extra um, ad so now let's go next so then I have to choose what do I want to add now I'm going to say select an exist use existing page use a selected page that's fine Instagram account I want to do, do this is new they changed okay select post right here so Facebook on my page this is the one I want actually so let's just go ahead and do that there we go and this is what it's going to look like right it's going to look like this and these are the different uh, looks Facebook marketplace I don't actually you know one thing I want to do is I want to change where it's posting I don't want it to go to Instagram I just want to go into uh, Facebook so I'm going to go and set the doo -doo -doo -doo, the, the the placements manual placements I just want it to be on Facebook I don't want it on Instagram right now okay there we go next and now it's going to be do 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 use existing post that's right perfect my pixel my url I don't need really I could probably use that but anyways so I'm just going to do that so now I'm going to set up an ad it doesn't mean it's going to be approved lots of times they but I'm just going to click on publish and now I'm going to end up with an ad to that post so hopefully that'll grow the comments on it it'll people will see it more be interested hopefully to see if that works um the the you know one of the things about uh, Facebook is that they have these verifications as to whether you're typically posting things about certain things or not and in your past and there's risks to using Facebook only for things like this but this is kind of how you do it how you create a post then you attach mini chat to it to reply to the post and send people to someplace else and send them a message and also get them on your mini chat list and then after that you have access to them and you can potentially uh, grow them I'm actually going to do automation here I'm going to create a new flow uh new flow uh, no it's not a flow I don't want a flow I want a sequence sequences there you go I want a new sequence so let's call this um get email so I'm going to create this and the first message is going to go to do, 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 you, you, do, do. let's go in here um uh, where's the message introduction starting step who you are and why they yes uh, yeah, yeah. yep 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 okay so what do I want I want to send a message what is this this is new it's changed from before right so you've edit oh I want to edit it there you go okay so the first thing I want to do here is I want to say uh remind your subscriber hey hey it's js here again thanks so much so much for your interest 
in my content a little while back you engaged on one of my posts which is how you got in my list I don't want to spam you so I'll ask here ask here if you'd like like to remain a subscriber okay so I'm basically what I'm doing right now I'm creating a flow this is a little bonus because I'm, I want to do this I might as well show you how to do it myself uh you're so you can do it too basically what I'm and what I'm going to do is I'm going to send this to people after three days of connecting to any of my uh, comments right so you'll see how that works in a second so first I'm going to send them this it's going to say you know me and then I'm going to say um, by the way you can always leave my list by typing stop okay that's a that's a default thing that that's set up already in mini chat that people can unsubscribe now one of the things is I remember when I started I was kind of like oh, I don't want to give people the option to get out of my list what if what if I have something later that they're interested in and I won't be able to send it to them well the thing you have to realize is that if somebody does not want to be in your list you should not keep them they will not like you sending them stuff later they might mark you as bad they might mark you as spam and then that that causes a black mark on you and maybe Facebook blocks you and delete your page all these things are possible so just go ahead and encourage them to unsubscribe anytime you send them something so there so now the next step is send another message oh actually I need to uh, I need to add a button here so add a button I want to say yes can yes um uh, uh, uh let's say continue if you want if you want to remain click the continue button button below okay so now what happens is I want I want them to to only be uh to stay on the list and only send them the information if they click the button if they don't click the button I'm not sending them anything more right I don't want to if they're not clicking continue that means they don't want more info right so I'm going to just do that I'm going to say uh doo -doo -doo -doo. continue is going to send another message so we're going to go in here we're going to add here and this is going to be just an other I don't even know what that's for but anyways I guess it's for anything else um so this is an other this is also an other and over here is the other message okay so now this one here is going to say great appreciate appreciate you so much okay and then I'm going to say add another message so there should be a delay this is weird is this new because there used to be a delay oh so you gotta actually put the delay right in yeah you still have to do that okay I'm gonna move this up here I'm gonna make a delay of three seconds okay um before going so the first thing the first thing I'd like to make sure of is that is that we can keep keep in touch Facebook Messenger is great, but they, the big, but Big Brother, Big Brother controls it, controls it. So I prefer having your email in case uh, something happens to my Facebook. Okay. Um, type your email. Type your email below. Below. Okay. So now I want to do user input. 
and I'm going to say oops I'm going to say that here okay so I'm going to do that I'm going to put type your in, in email below and then what's going to happen is so perform an action so the, the reply text is email there we go save email to system field yes and contact has responded uh, choose next step you can start another automation without a reply I forget what this is retry message if the answer is incorrect correct email address skip button retry three times user if is invalid okay so this is all new it's changed from what it used to be uh and the thing is that you can have an automation here that automatically uh, adds them to a neighbor list right or something like that so for now I'm just going to do this I need to go oh well we're already 35 minutes in so I, I don't know if I want to uh, continue this in the this recording let me just see what happens here perform action what are the actions I want to add a tag all oh, right yeah I want to be doing that stuff yes yes so uh subscribe to sequence could be it could be a sequence remove a tag unsubscribe from sequence mark conversation assign notify admins <coughs> subscribe to bot unsubscribe set okay so that's the thing so I want to um so I could have different sequences so that I could for example whenever they whenever they 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 click this say an action I should probably I'll just publish this for now publish flow you with user input block on a free account oh so you can't actually do that you can't publish a flow with user input block on a free account okay so I guess you need the um, you need the pro account to be able to do this what I wanted to do here oh okay well that's fine so at least it's uh that's great that they let you actually create it <laughs> be nice if they told you that you had to have the free account waiting for a reply from contact if contact has not responded oh, okay click that in action let's delete that for now no delete this okay so action on reply next step so that's kind of let's just uh, go smaller here and see the whole thing <clears throat> there you go so this is a sequence a sequence is something you now okay so now I have the sequence I still have to fix it I probably have to go to pro to use it but if I go into my uh, growth tools here I can actually go to this growth tool here right and inside of the opt-in actions in this dot in this message I can actually have a action right here I can add an action whoops let's just do that add an action and I can say the action will be subscribe to sequence and now I have to enter the sequence the get email and I'm going to say publish now it's going to probably give me an error oh that's weird it doesn't give me an error because the sequence is not even published so that's the one that I created just now so that means that after they do this they're going to get that sequence if I go back to the sequences <clears throat> now I want to edit this sequence I want it to do, 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 immediate not immediately this is not immediately I want it to be uh, not immediate I wanted to send it after three days three days save <clears throat> okay so that means that they're going to send this message which isn't uh, real right now but anyways we'll see because I have this as the unedited <coughs> and let's edit this again I think I have the edited one here yeah I gotta take that out of there okay let's just uh well I guess I can just delete this for now and just say over here I want to send the message great great happy to have you here next the next message will be coming soon okay so the, now what I'm just going to do instead I'm just going to have a next step I'm going to do a uh, whoops that's not what I want 
can I do uh did you do actions there you go so next step is just going to be a subscribe or add a tag actually I'm going to call it Seinfeld because that's what I like to use in my um in my thing so there you go and that's going to add the tag Seinfeld and I'm going to publish this there so now that means that I can broadcast to Seinfeld tag people so if they if they actually and add this tag then that means I can use that later on I can go into broadcasting broadcasting and I can create a broadcast and I think messenger okay I can set up a add text hey my friend have you seen my last blog post now this is only going to send now um add a button tell me okay and then it's going to be a send a message it's going to be a it's going to be a I don't know okay I'm going to say uh you can it's all about starting your own business with a Chrome extension and then let's just uh, I don't know let's go to my blog and just uh, actually I think that there's an automation you can do as well broadcast paid messages no um mm -hmm. there's so much stuff you can do with mini chat it's totally crazy I definitely need to go and get back on my um over here I gotta say add a button go to blog post right and it's going to open a website and it's going to be let's say this page so chrome extension how to get others to promote people how oh, you can start your own and there you go this one here let's use this one so this will be the, the url for it I'm just going to put it in here and done and then it's going to be let's put the text the actual text of it right uh well actually it should be this whole thing course income secrets the 21 there you go there you go so now I'm just going to do that whoops go to next okay so now whoops sending tag content non-promotional or mixed I forget what that is non-promotional message tags apply tag each message that comes before or after the I forget this is they they've changed right a lot of stuff so I'm going to say messenger is true add a condition I want to add the tag and it's going to be is Seinfeld right so that's only going to be sent to that schedule for later let's say it's going to be tomorrow at so 10 let's say 10 a.m there you go and time zone I'm going to send it time travel which means it's going to send it at that time in their time zone regular push and only regular two regular just do a regular push okay so um it's non-promotional and then schedule looks like no one fits the selected all oh, right that's fine okay so that's because I don't have any anybody in there yet okay so now let's just go back to the broadcast I don't think it it's going to be saved in my broadcast content it's a draft broadcast maybe I should give it a name here so cis321 I'm just going to do that all right so now I have this over here cis321 the type what's the type hmm okay anyways that's that's how you send a broadcast now I, I have to have people in that with that sign for tag which I don't have yet because that's all brand new I'm just setting all that up but that's how you get a post and then a mini chat integration so that it replies to it 
and how you set up an ad and we even talked about broadcasting all right so hopefully you enjoyed this and if you have any questions you can always comment I would love to hear your thoughts as well on this go ahead and comment below and let me know what you think and let's have a conversation if you need any help we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Ooh. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.